at Dollar Tree. Let's see how much money they're gonna take from me today. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Jungle in my pocket. That is actually so adorable. These are all the little things you can get. I'm gonna get two of these. These little golden eggs are packaged so sweetly. Oh my gosh, we've got some big name brand nail polishes here. I love Insta-Try Sally Hansen. Sally Hansen Heart as Nails. We've got this color, which is so pretty. Friends, a friend's channel. Wait, is that black? I was really coming for the beauty section today and look, sometimes you just don't hit the right stores at the right time, you know? That was super cute. Okay, this sign is actually amazing for $1.25. What? Ooh, what's that? A table runner? So cute. I already have this one. This one's just 10 out of 10. Look at these two. So cute. Then we've got pillow covers. The pink and blue. Some of these eggs are ruined. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, we're gonna get these. Okay, this is really cute. I don't think I have this one. So we'll get that. And this is one of my favorites. Kind of rare to find, although it looks like they have a pretty big stack. So I'm gonna get that one. But then there's this one back here with the school the school bus. Yeah, we're gonna get the school bus one too. The fact that this one is still around is like shocking me. I wish they would bring back some of their OG stickers, like the blue elephant. I love the robots, so I'm gonna get those. I've been on the hunt for this Hello Kitty, like, coloring activity book. But, once again, I'm not seeing it, but as you can see, the store is just so picked over. I think this is a high traffic store. Um, yeah, so I think, I don't think I'm gonna come back to this one again, but... myself. Wait, that is so cute. Oh my gosh. Look at the trucks and the taxi. That's cute. Wait, these are new color wheels and little alien spaceship. That's adorable. Little bird houses, gnomes, calculators. I have most of these. Okay, I don't think I have these. These are so cute. The stickers with the grid. Alright, so this store took $36.50. That's before tax. So $1.25, $36.50 divided by $1.25 will give us the number of items. So I'll go ahead and share with you guys what I got. I did get two of the Mr. Clean Magic Erasers. This is just for moving purposes, you know, just to kind of like um, do some light cleaning. Um, then you did see that I got these cute little carrot picks. Are these new? Why, why is my brain not remembering if these are new or not? Like, did I get these last year in Florida? I feel, I don't know, it could go either way. I'm sure one of you might, re might remember. So I got the smaller ones and then the bigger ones. So the bigger ones you get two for $1.25 to the pack. The smaller ones you get three. These are just going to look so lovely in like planters and florals and even wreaths, all the all the things. You can even um, clip off these sticks at the bottom and just like put them and style them in a tear tray. 
so those are super cute couldn't believe it i had to get these little um jungle in my pockets i want to actually get these for micah um these just are so adorable here are the ones that you can collect um so there's just really cute things on here like an alligator prowler i don't know so i'm gonna go ahead and open these but i'm gonna go back and get micah some oh my gosh i got him he's so cute that's prowler he's a black panther so adorable okay and then these are blind bags you don't really know what you're gonna get oh and i got the chomper which is a warthog so super cute i'm really lucky that i didn't get a dupe <clears throat> you just never know with blind bags i was actually hoping for the alligator is what i was hoping for um but i'm i knew i was going to open these up on camera and then i realized i should have grabbed more so that i could have them for micah anyways all right so then shocking find these nail polishes these big name brand nail polishes like what we've got hard as nails sally hansen in the color rock me baby so cute and then this is a friends nail polish in this uh, yellow color and the color is yellow taxi and then we've got color whirl and this is in the color steampunk super cute so i got those now these two items i don't think you guys saw in the clips but i've actually been looking for them for a minute i had no idea that yardley was putting out sprays now up until this point i thought yardley was strictly like soap i think i've seen them do like some type of like pump hands hand soap and maybe a body wash maybe but i recently saw someone show these on tiktok and i was like huh so i had to find them for myself so it is a fine fragrance body mist and this one's an english rose and this one is in summer breeze so i was so excited that i finally found it because the person i saw show them like showed it months ago but sometimes that's just how dollar tree works this was a dollar tree that i've before i moved to florida i used to go to it a lot anyways i've always known this particular dollar tree to be like super high traffic like their stuff is always just kind of like messy um and because you know it's hard to keep up when you have a lot of foot traffic so that's not in any way like a negative thing in, in me saying that um but it is just the the fact that you know it's very picked over and i don't know if i just like came at the wrong time while they were stocking but my personal experience with that store has always been <clears throat> that they they are they that store just looks like that all the time so i think i might retire that store but maybe once in a blue moon i might just like always pop in to see if there's an update because i have hit some pretty good jackpots at that one all right next up is this 2024 planner i actually saw it in pink like somebody had pulled a couple of them out and pink was laying on top and i was like if they have this in black i would take it home and then i looked down and they did they had it in four total colors pink was one of them i think green and purple and black and i just was like you know what this would look really cute sitting on my office desk and i could just put like major things that are going on that day i don't know that i'll go into detail but because i already have like a whole to do journal that i use but because these are all basically this is a month at a glance this is not a weekly calendar um i thought that the monthly would be great because i don't have anything that's monthly right now and fun fact but when i really started my calendar planner journey if some of you have been with me long enough you might remember this but i had those big desk calendars like the big huge ones that you get at like walmart and i had one at my office like when i would actually go into a building and in, in an office and but i would make mine really cute i would color mine and do like all kinds of things and it would have like micah's cheer schedule and her her practices and all of that so i actually started 
with month at a glances. Long story. I got another one of these trouble little board games. They're just so cute and I love them for junk journaling. Top tier for that. Then I picked up these two new items. So new item alerts. These are little mini board games, Mickey Mouse and Peppa Pig. Of course, I had to pull them for, I wanted to just kind of see what these little pieces looked like um, and see if I could work with them from a junk journaling perspective. I mean, even the covers are cute and you can use the covers to create a junk journal. Also, I have a new concept I want to try and do with junk journaling. And I can't wait for that. I think it's how I'm going to start my lives back again is this concept. I'm going to talk about it um, very soon. Um, so stick with me. As soon as I move, I'm going to try to get back on doing YouTube lives on Sundays. And it's just strictly junk journaling. So anyways, that was information, but not any information that like helped you in any way. But anyways, all right. Next up, these are the stickers that I got, which you guys saw. I just love these little school stickers. And then of course I had to get another of the robots. Love robots, love anything like alien robots. I think it's super cute. I don't think I have this one. Maybe, maybe I've pulled it like one time, I don't know. But the bathing suit and the flip flops are really cute. So I'm gonna have to find more of those. And then I got these little labels. The graph on it is really special. And then I take it these flashcards. These are probably the best, in my opinion, when dealing with flashcards and junk journaling from Dollar Tree. Like, they're just really good. Then I found these erasers. Now, most of you know that I'm on this journey now to find really cute novelty erasers, and I'm gonna fill up a whole um, little caboodle that I got for my niece, because I used to collect erasers when I was a kid. Long story short, I'm looking at erasers now. Now these I don't think I'm gonna put in hers, but they blew me away. And I wanted you guys to know <gasps> that they're a Dollar Tree. These are jumbo erasers, but they're like food. So this one's sour cream and onion. That That's a whole eraser. The whole thing is an eraser. Then we have the original Pringles and the eraser's blue on that one. Then we have Cheez-Its and we have Ego like home style waffles. This would be a really great find for maybe it's an inside joke or maybe you know like the older crowd and putting their Easter basket. Maybe you're gonna put some Pringles and then you put the eraser. I don't know. That could be like a super cute idea. So I just had to pick those up and show you guys that they're there. And of course, the last things totaling this $36. Actually, not everything was a dollar twenty-five. So I'm just gonna, yeah. So I can't do that division. I can't do $36.50 divided by $1.25 because that's not gonna give us the correct number of items because these cards were a dollar each, not a dollar 25. So I'll put up the, the correct number of items here. All right, these are the cards that I got. And of course I personally junk journal with them. Um, I love the rocket ship. Yeah, anything space, so cute. I can definitely like, if I wanted to, I could just remove it and use that. It's also totally okay when junk journaling to keep everything. Like, there's no rules, and it's that's why I love it so much. I picked up this St. Patty's Day one. I thought it gave off somewhat of a vintage vibe. I don't know if it's this font right here, but that was really cool. So I got it. And it's more beautiful in person. Like, when you're junk journaling with this, the, the green is like a foil. It's gorgeous. And the last one is this one. So cute. Love it. Um, also for junk journaling. But that's it. That's today's haul. Honestly, $36.50 for me is a good day. Because I go in there and I lose my ever loving mind. Um, but that's what $36.50 looks like from Dollar Tree. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see you next time.